Hey everybody, this is Scott with Integrity. I haven't made a video in a little bit, a little while, but I noticed that people are watching them and seem to be enjoying them. So I wanted to put out some really good how-to videos because that seems to be what people are liking. So this one is about how to change in Windows 10 uh, your wi your Wi-Fi preference. So like, let's say you're at home and you've got a few different networks, or you're just somewhere where you there's a lot of networks that you've joined, and your computer always seems to join the wrong one. Okay, now in Windows 7, this is really easy. In Windows 10, it's a little bit harder. Um, I, I believe you have to do it through command line. It may be, you may be able to do it through the interface. I'm not positive, but I don't, I don't think you can. So let me show you how to do it through command line. Now, I'm actually going to follow a tutorial online because even though I know how to do this, I haven't memorized it, the command line commandlets. And if you're like me, it's a lot more helpful if you can see this done rather than just read about it. So, and I'm even gonna follow along with this little tutorial for you. So what you're gonna to wanna to do in Windows 10 is come down here to your start button, right click and open up command prompt admin, okay? That's called an elevated command prompt. So you wanna do that. Now, what you're gonna type is net sh wlan show profiles. Now, what that's gonna do is show all the Wi-Fi networks you've ever joined on this computer. Now for me, it's quite a bit because I use this for work. Okay. Now it's also going to show you right here, profiles on interface, wireless network connection. Now that is the name of my wireless network adapter. That's going to become important. So if you look up here, it says all user profile, uh, Bubba Barn, that's actually my home network. And I already did this. I already prioritized it, but it wasn't automatically there. Let's just assume it wasn't. So let's say I want to set that network as the highest priority network that my computer should join. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to type net sh wlan set profile order name equals, now you have to do the parentheses. And this is the name of your Wi-Fi network, okay? I don't think it's case sensitive, but you you do have to have spaces if that's in there. So name equals quote, Bubba Barn quote, interface, this is the important part, okay? This is the name of your wireless network adapter. And it's probably different for a lot of you. Um, what was it again? See right here, wireless network connection. So that's what I'm gonna call it. And it has to be in parentheses. Wireless network connection priority equals one. So net sh wlan set profile order name equals quote bubba barn quote space interface equals quote wireless network connection quote space network or sorry space priority equals one remember you have to have the quotes the name right here is the wireless the wi-fi network you want it to join as priority number one in quotes the interface is the name of your network adapter if you're not sure what it is it will show you right here another way to find out is hit your uh, Windows key, type ncpa.cpl, and it'll open up this screen, and you see right here, wireless network connection, Bubba Barn. That's the name of my wireless network adapter. So we have this typed in, hit enter. Okay, profile order for profile Bubba Barn is not changed. Now it says not changed because it's already priority one. Now, had it not been priority one, it would have said it's been changed to priority one. And that's it. And if at that point you want to confirm that it is priority, type CLS, only because CLS clears out everything you did, okay? And again, you can type net sh wlan show profiles. And Bubba Barn is number one. That's all there is to it. It's really that easy. I wish I could show you on Windows 7 because it's actually a lot easier. Um, but that's how you do it in Windows 10. This is a little bit of a power user move, but it's not that difficult. And I don't think you're really going to screw too much up. Um, do it just like this video and you'll be all squared away.